Dallas, Texas. Welcome everyone and what a game we have for you tonight as we get set to bring you NBA action on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Brett Perry. From the sideline, we'll have David Aldridge. We'll be hearing from him in just a moment. So the opening lineup for the Suns. Aiton is the pivot, and Crowder slides in at the four. The star backcourt of Paul and Booker are out there, and it's Bridges in at the three. And for the Mavericks, Reggie Bullock is out there with Jalen Brunson. Then there's Dwight Powell. Then there's Luka Doncic, and it's Finney Smith in at the power forward. start out. Now, here's Doncic. And Doncic throws it down. Slam down by Doncic. A monster in the backcourt at 6 7 Booker inside. He's guarded by Bullock. Powell oh, against Aiden. Lock at six. Pass to Paul. A three ball. It's good from long range. Paul. The defenses cannot let his range go unchallenged when CP3 gets it going from there. And Chris Paul still a great defender. Fantastic position. Well, not only the positioning, but if you watch Chris Paul, he's calling out every option of every play that every offense is running in the NBA. That kind of intelligence gives the rest of his group incredible confidence. And from the very beginning, Chris Paul has been one of the most disruptive point guards defensively the league has ever seen. And here is Paul. After Luka Doncic hitting the three, Paul passes to Crowder. And the pass to Aiton. And Aiton throws it down. And Jay Crowder moving it to the open man. For Dallas, they've gone two or three here to start out the game. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Alder. Yes, Kevin, I caught up with Jason Kidd just a few minutes ago. He knows that Devin Booker is going to get his points. But what they want to do is prevent the freebies. Coach said Booker's become exceptional at drawing fouls. And he's one of the best free throw shooters in the game. So, Kevin, they don't want to see him on the line multiple times tonight. Back to you. All right, thank you, David. Bridges misses. Well, that's not a shot he's ever going to pass up, and he shouldn't. Despite the miss, no defender anywhere near him. He's got to shoot that one. And right off the bat, super sharp here offensively. Four of five so far. Paul passes to Bridges. Here's Crowder. Jacks up a three. And it's Finney Smith with the rebound. For Dallas, they've gone four of five from the field so far. Passes it to Brunson. For three, Bullock gets the three-point of the fall. This is the kind of start they were hoping for. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. They need this. Yes, that goes in. Chris Paul. Paul's got five points so far. He is a master craftsman when he gets inside and carves out space at the mid-range. CP3 with another deuce. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. the defensive scheme, and he just waited for his teammate to be open. Down low, and Finney Smith gets it to go. There are only a few players in the league who can hit a teammate like that in stride. Beautiful assist. Ball kicks to Bridget. Aiton with it, defended by Dinwiddie. And Aiton throws it down. Aiden just up over the top at his size to throw that one down. Runs in the pass 
to Finney Smith. Dinwiddie outside. making some changes. JaVale McGee's checked in for DeAndre Ayton. Johnson comes in for Crowder. And it's Tory Craig in for Mikhail Bridges. As a big, once you get positioned inside, it allows you to fight and come away with a lot of tough boards. Here's Dinwiddie. The dish to Doncic. Count it good. How about the balance of Doncic on that possession? Amazing at just absorbing the contact and still with the strength. To finish. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Mavericks. Because they're passing the ball the way you're supposed to here in this first round. Another part of the game set where they've been effective is to get points in the paint. That free throw good from Doncic. And during that second year in the league, Luka Doncic took the lead, averaging 28, 9, and 9, looking like the European version of LeBron James. Ball stolen. Kleba against Paul. And they double up Doncic. Pass to Dinwiddie. Times in the post. McGee's there. Really yeah, the right play. Defensively, if he can't block, that's his force him to the line. Second team. For Dallas, they have gone one for one, making their That's previous the attempt at the line. Dominic Bertone. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. One falls for Green, he's checked in for Dallas. Payne, he's checked in for the Suns. And so Bertrand nails both of them. Big fellow with the ability and confidence at the free throw line is something that every team wants. You don't have to make those late substitutions. Keep your big guys on the floor. Now here's Payne. Oh, and that one had the right spin Payne. on it, and it is good. 51 seconds left to play in the first quarter. And they double up Doncic. Bertans kicks to Green. To the middle. Here's Doncic. Lee Bass was put in just the right spot. Doncic has got 14 points for the game. It just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just a great ball move. Green finds Booker. We've got 22 seconds left to play here in the first. In the way up off the glass. Devin Booker will score by any means necessary, and that time over decent defense, getting the contact. Donchich outside. Pass to Bertons. Let's the three fly. Good. And the assist goes to Donchich. Five points in the game. The swing intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Yeah, if you walked in at any point during this game to watch five minutes of play, one team played harder. We know who that was. It's been all about Luka Doncic for Dallas. He totaled 14 points in the quarter. He's given them all the offense they need right now. And we'll be right back after this. And so far through 
one quarter. It's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in a second. And guys, we've seen a confident-looking Mavericks team out there. In that first period, they showed a willingness to make the extra pass. So much unselfish play out there. The coaching staff has to be thrilled with that. Greg, you played on one of college basketball's all-time super teams. Hard to imagine we'll see that kind of dominance over several seasons like you guys had at UNLV. It's true, and we still see dominant teams, but, you know, the difference is now the most talented teams tend to only play together for one season, and, and so that makes it really hard to run together stretches where you can call yourself a legitimate dynasty. But I still love where our game is and look forward to watching these young men chase their dreams. And now, brought to you by Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset our lineups. On the floor for Dallas, Reggie Bullock is out there with Davis Berton. And it's Green. Then there's Doncic, and it's Kleba in at the five spot. It's his second foul, but not the end of the world. One more before halftime, though. That would change some things. Dallas leading by 11. Here's Doncic. 14 points for him. Kleba with the bucket. Kleba's got his first points of the game. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Trey passes to Payne. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Luka Doncic. That's his first foul. First team foul. And you can see he just didn't get squared up on his feet. And some changes here for the Mavericks. Powell, well, he's jacked in for Maxi Kleba. Dorian Finney-Smith comes in for Davis Bertans. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Reggie Bullock. Now here's Paul. Five points in the game. Crowder inside. Can't hit the turnaround jumper. Well, that's a shot they want just about on every possession, if they can get it. He doesn't make them all, but still very much a high percentage look. Green against Booker. Green kicks to Powell. Five on the clock. Fires top of the key. He hits the back iron and sinks the shot. Doncic has got 16. A great disruptor of the basketball. Luka taking matters into his own hands tonight. Great to see him play like this. Now here's Booker. Picks it out to Paul. Let's it go from deep. Phoenix, no good that time either. Dallas leading by 15. Here's Doncic. Jay Crowder with the rebound. I'm not going to see that very often. The defense in the vicinity, but still, he's not one to blow layups. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. As NBA revenues climb into the tens of billions of dollars, teams have even more resources to compete. Staffs are growing with more coaches, trainers, and specialists, so general managers have more to manage than ever. Generally, the best organizations are those that effectively collaborate and communicate across the board. Kevin? And DA, as we know, that's always been the case. Devin Thank you. Booker. A nice shot by Booker. Ball. Just not thinking eight. about it twice. Devin Booker with the ball. He's going to let it rip. No secret here, Brent. Devin yeah. Booker known for his offense. But his defense has come a long way as well. Yeah, it's so funny when scorers come into the league and, and they score and people are still critical of them. That's what happened to Devin Booker. And then he realizes the games became bigger and more important how much the defensive end is going to help his team do the things he wants to do. And so he's taken that tune. He's decided to play defense. He's been much better over the course of the last two seasons. And the Mavericks making a change here. Then when he's set there. What determination from Doncic pushing his shot through despite some stiff defense to draw the foul. Now let's shoot their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. And at the line shot. last season, about 78% as a team. Pretty solid numbers. Shoot two. And the first one drops.
free throw is good from Doncic. Here's Paul. Five points in the game. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Backs it out to Booker. And the jumper falls for him. Booker's got six points. Yeah, a good contest, but if Booker has his eyes on the rim before you get there on the closeout, chances are he's going to score. And they double up Doncic. Dishes to Powell. And here is Doncic. He's got 18. Inside, Vinny Smith. Jay Crowder with the rebound. And you can see he just rushed that a little bit. Lost the focus, Dr. And it's Aiton missing. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Mavericks. Only giving up six here in this quarter. Finney Smith kicks to Doncic. Dinwiddie passes to Pop. Six on the shot clock. This one for three. He doesn't hit that one. The Suns go the other way with it. The pass to Paul. Bridges outside. Crowder against Dinwiddie. Crowder dishes to Paul. And that the whistle blows. Foul. It's going to be on Luka Doncic. That's foul number two for him. And the Mavericks with some changes. Maxi Kleba, he's checked in seven. for Powell. Bertinus comes in for Dorian Finney-Smith. And it's Reggie Bullock in for Jalen Brunson. Dinwiddie covering. A floater. McGee controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. You know we talk about it all the time, guys. Those second chance buckets, always the result of that extra effort. Dinwiddie attacking. Falls through. He's now made two of four. Well, if you're giving up that much height, the only thing that you can do as a defender is to foul him. Pain with it. Defended by Dinwiddie. to McGee. Now Shannon still looking for his first bucket in this one. A three-pointer is right on target. Three points. The defense so concerned with Shamit and his shot-making ability, he makes the play that time. Doncic against Clay. A shot by Bertrand. Nobody around. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Bertrand's got eight. Answer back there. Love to see the competitor. Both teams finding ways to the three-point line and trying to take advantage from distance. And it goes, and the Dallas lead has got down to 11 on the bucket from Payne. Dallas has gone 4-6 from outside the arc tonight. Now Chich with it. He's got 18. What a great performance from the field. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thank you, Kevin. Here with Coach Jason Kidd. Jason, how do you feel about your team's performance? I feel great. You know, we're sharing the ball, we're making extra pass, but we're attacking the paint. And if we can continue to do that, it puts us in a good seat. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Luka Doncic had a huge first quarter. He had 18 points, three assists, and one rebound. Shaq, what's your take on Dallas? They've really established themselves on the glass. Being dominant there has been extra possessions, which they've cashed in on. Now they just got to, you know, bring the same energy to the second half. Kenny, your take on Phoenix. 
The free throw margin is very telling. One team is playing aggressively, getting to the line, and the other one just isn't. You have to be willing to play through the contact in this league. After a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. You know, Luka Doncic has been exceptional here, guys. There's something that isn't his strength, but he's done a great job of finding the open man. Well, if we were grading playmaking today, it's an A-plus from him. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. Yeah, Getting right. underway in the second half, Assisted here's the five for Monty Williams. A star backcourt of Paul and Booker are out there. Up it forward, they'll have Bridges and Crowder. And it's Aiden in at the five. Here's Doncic following the basket by DeAndre Aiden. And there it is for him. <laughs> Doncic has got 20 points. And with good width and athleticism, Doncic not only gets to the rim, but boy, can he finish. Powell against Paul. Here's Aiton. And it's Finney Smith with the rebound. Finney Smith's got rebound number five here tonight. Dinwiddie against Crowder. up top. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Shot clock at five. Launches it. It's hauled in by the Suns. Now, here's eight to the left side wing. From 11 feet away. And the shot is good. The Maverick lead has been cut to just nine points on the basket from Chris Paul. Chris Paul, a crafty finisher, gets inside, and despite being six feet, will find a way to get it done. Now, here's Dinwiddie. Powell in the high post. That's to Finney Smith. Feeds it to Doncic. And here's Brunson. From 12 feet out. Good! And the assist goes to Doncic. Doncic has got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Suns trailed by 11. Here's Booker. He's got six. Knocks down the step back, Jay. Booker's got eight points. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Here's Dinwiddie. A second chance effort. And it's good on the way here. He's got six. That's a testament to the effort there on the boards. Never willing to give up on the possession, finding ways to sniff out the ball. Now, here's a, here's Booker. Score the bucket. He's made five so far, shooting a very clean five of seven. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. The 10 footer. Good. He hits the jump shot. Doncic has got four points now in the fourth. And sometimes there's just nothing you can do against Doncic. He's terrific at keeping his focus on the rim. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. All right, thank you, guys. What we have seen today's athletes taking stands for social justice. All-star Bradley Beal says, we understand there will be a backlash. We don't care about that. I'm a human being, a citizen, just like everybody else. I have family and friends still living in those environments. I'm their voice. Kevin? All right, David, thank you very much. Now here's Booker. Ten points for him. Stolen by Brunson. Here's Dinwiddie. Rips down the breakaway swing. In the all-around game of Doncic, not just a score, but a great dime dropper as well. Notices his open teammates quickly. With three, Booker. And a great assist by Paul as that one goes in. Well, the defense very attentive to him in the first quarter, but he's finally gotten loose in the second and making them pay. Doncic with the bucket. Doncic has got 24. This shooting has been outstanding. <laughs> Definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. Look around side. 
Shot clock at six. Two minutes. Duke Cobert in with it. And off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for him. Aiton's got four points now in the fourth. Time out, time out. But you always want DeAndre Aiton to play more aggressively, don't you? Well, it's when he's at his best, especially when he's down low and, and using his frame. He's, he's kind of like you know, this young kid that doesn't realize how big he is, but he's starting to understand how much his size can impact what he can do on both ends of the floor. A different look for Dallas. Maxi Kleba, he's checked in for Powell. Bertinus comes in for Dorian Finney-Smith, and it's Reggie Bullock in for Dinwiddie. A big group substitution here for Phoenix. JaVale McGee's checked in for DeAndre Johnson comes in for Jake Crump. Tory Crane, he's checked in for Bridges, and it's Payne in for Chris Paul. Here's Payne. After Luka Doncic's bucket, Payne finds Craig. Makes it out to Booker. Stolen by Booker. And it's the Mavericks on the break. Now the pass to Doncic. Three left in the third quarter. It's over McGee, and the shot is good. Dropping in off the front of the rim. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for Dallas. The activity level defensively, I I've really been impressed with. There's been an attack mode on the defensive line. A significant difference here has been the number of points off turnovers that they've got. Here's Booker after Luka Doncic's bucket. No good from Booker. Mavericks leading by 14. Kleba, the pass to Doncic. Takes it inside. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's his second personal foul. In Europe, Doncic spent a lot of time as a primary guard. Oh, you see the craftiness there in terms of drawing fouls. He's shooting free throws. Number four in five here. Free throw good from Doncic. Dallas making a switch here. Green's checked in, and the Suns also making a change. Mikael Bridges checked in for Devin Booker. All free throws good from Doncic. And so it's Payne with it. He'll bring it up for the Suns. It's a 16-point game. Johnson outside, over Green. Johnson, good. Johnson. Johnson's got his first two points. Mavericks have gone eight of 10 shooting here in the second half. Very strong. Doncic kicks to Green. Just three on the clock. Doesn't get it to drop for him. And as we end the third quarter, a double digit deficit will make it tough to come back. Mavericks lead by 14. And we'll get going after this from the American Airlines Center. And a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assists of the game. Uh, just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Yeah, those are the kind of plays that you want to put on a canvas. Just beautiful basketball. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today. As we get going in quarter number four. We've got Luka Doncic. Reggie Bullock is out there with Jalen Brunson. Then there's Davis Bertans, and it's Kleba in at the center, filling out the middle. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. Here's Craig. Kleba with the rebound. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. And there's a whistle. There's on Mikael Bridges. That'll be his second foul of the game. That's only the first turnover, guys. He's been safe as an option for them at the offensive end. Catching up on the changes for Phoenix. Crowder comes in for Torrey Craig. And Paul subbed in for Bridges. Now here's Bullock. Here's Bertans for three. 
that shot off. To the paint, Crowder the pass to Paul. And there's the foul. Jalen Brunson. That's his first, that's first, his first foul. foul. First yeah, that's, team it's foul. close, but, you know, didn't get on balance quick enough. Fourth quarter of basketball. We're about a minute into it. Paul finds McGee. Jim 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 back McGee. in for two. Chris Paul came into the league playing unselfish. Continues to do so. What a dime. Doncic looking it over. And the dunk by Doncic. And that kind of sums up how this game is going. Uh -huh. Attack minded all the way. Yeah, great read. Calls his own number and then sends it home. Now here's Paul. And we've made our way through just over a minute and a half in this fourth quarter. Quickness of Chris Paul dicing up the defense with his superb passing off the screen. Dallas calls timeout. for JaVale McGee. And Mikael Bridges subbed in for Johnson. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge who's reporting from the sideline. Well, I was able to listen in on what Jason Kidd went over with his team. He talked about the mindset they need to have and what he wants to see the rest of the way. Engagement at both ends and making good decisions with the ball. Hey, guys. Thank you, David. And now six straight points here coming on the inside. Doncic kicks to Bertans. Doncic. Hooked away. To the middle. Here's Pertinus. Well timed pass. And they go straight to the bucket for the layup. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices he out there for texting, so they might as well talk to one another. That's his to be in a legal screen. Yeah, everybody saw that one. That was pretty blatant there. And the Mavericks with some changes. Dorian Finney-Smith comes in for Davis Bertons. And Dinwiddie subbed in for Reggie Bullock. And the Suns also making a change. Devin Booker, he's checked in for paint. Now, here's Dinwiddie. Takes it up with both hands and rips it down. And there is no better way to add to the lead. In that true GA, especially when the slam is coming from the point guard. Oh, yeah. His teammates love that one. I'm sure he's going to hear about it when he gets to the huddle. Here's Bridges. Six to shoot. Crowder the pass to Booker. Releases. Misses off the left eye. And with the success they've had rebounding the basketball, they're right where you'd expect them to be, firmly in the driver's seat. Rejected by Booker. And that's out of bounds. Dallas will retain possession. And now let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. And that block might serve as a spark for this team. We'll see if it can ignite them. from Booker. Sign of a great score is even though the defense starts to get more physical, it keeps you unfazed. And Devin Booker is that right now. Now, here's Doncic. Bridges with some nice defense. This is at the ball. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Dinwiddie against Booker. Here's the three. Another three Devin for Phoenix. Timeout, timeout. The Three. confidence of Devin Booker when he gets a screen, he knows what he wants to do. Dallas calls timeout. They're up by nine. Ladies and gentlemen, one fifty-three left in the fourth quarter. And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Luka Doncic.
Doncic. Yeah, and his performance has been a jaw dropper. It must have been feeling great coming into the building tonight because once he hit the court, it was all working for him. He was in a zone. He sure has given this crowd a treat tonight. This kind of performance only cements his status as a fan favorite. left in the fourth quarter. And here's Booker. Shoots over Dinwiddie. Misses the chippy right there. Shot didn't fall, but that play worked well to get a good look at the basket. Yeah, an efficient offensive possession. They found the look that they wanted, just didn't go in. That's the pop. First basket of the night. Suns trail by 11. Look around, son. It doesn't go for him. Great D that time from Paul. Guys, I think this is a game they have to feel good about as we wind through the final moments here in what looks to be a solid win for the Mavericks. Free throws were a big factor in this one. Well, it's always great to get a lot of shots at the line, but the key they were able to convert tonight. You start making free throws, and it can get you the win. The one player that really stands out, of course, in this one, it was a dazzling game for Luka Doncic. And with all these assists, it's obvious how well that you can see the entirety of the floor out there. If an easy bucket is to be had, he'll find it. They're in good position here to ride it out. Yeah, certainly. If they just play smart, this game's over. Shot and game clock separated by five. Here's Powell. Booker pulls it in. From deep three-point range, and Paul with the basket on the assist by Booker. Chris Paul has drained plenty of huge shots in his career. Easy to see why he's so revered. For three, Booker, good. And now just a three-point Maverick lead. And Booker, not just an onlooker. How about that one? And the Mavericks call time here. Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. He's Dallas taking this. What a show they put out here at home tonight. I mean, these are those games that feel so great to win, and, and really, it's like a knife in the gut to lose. Uh, you, you gotta love being on the edge of your seat and just wondering what's gonna happen. How is this thing gonna play out? Hey, Kevin, thank you. Here with Luca, you got the W. So, what did you think about your performance? You know, we got to win against team that's very competitive you know they go hard uh, no matter what you know they're a great team and you know i'm just glad we got a win we got to keep going like that hey man thanks for your time i really appreciate it back to you kevin all right david great job thanks so much and that about wraps it up for greg anthony brett berry and david aldridge this is kevin harlan thank you for watching the nba presented by 2k sports we'll see you next time